Winwing's Christmas sale starts December 21st. Hello valued viewers, I hope you're all doing very well and welcome back to the mini series where we try and find out what teleported back in time could have stopped a relatively realistic rendition of the Imperial Japanese Navy's fleet that attacked Pearl Harbor. We've done I think six videos so far. We actually thought we'd finish this by now, but a lot of you have requested extra things to try, so we're going to crack on with it. First of all, we tried, can a modern US carrier group stop the Imperial Japanese fleet, which involved 27 ships, including six carriers and 353 World War II aircraft, by the way, which is all modelled. No, it couldn't. We screwed it up. Then we did a rematch and we had a draw. Then we did a final attempt and we won. Then could a single F-15E stop the carrier group and it sort of could but we had to mess around because we had to get the AI to fly the F-15 because we can't fly the F-15E in game and it was a bit messy. Then we did could an AC-130 gunship and or A-10C warthogs stop it and we found not really they had the firepower but they're both just too cumbersome and slow when loaded up and the hostile World War II fighters would end up catching us and shooting us down. A lot of you have said the A-10C can actually outrun the World War II fighters, but the problem is those stats are not including heavy ordnance. When you load it up with heavy ordnance, it doesn't fly very high, and it certainly doesn't fly very fast, and we really struggled with that. Next, can you carpet bomb the Imperial Japanese Navy with B-1s? And yes, we could. And then could you put a nuke on it? And yes, you could as well. Next, you've asked, what about other modern naval and non-naval fighter bombers. So today we're trying it with a single F-16 paired with a single F-A-18C Legacy Hornet paired with a single F-14 Bravo. Can these guys, three of them in total, stop a relatively realistic rendition of the Imperial Japanese Navy attack on Pearl Harbor? A quick look at the Japanese, they have six period accurate carriers carrying 353, which is the correct number of aircraft launch. 75% of those will be ground attacks, 75 will be air to air. Then they've, I've done this so many times, I should know off by heart, but I think they've got nine destroyers, three cruisers, and two battleships, small battleships. There they are going over to here to attack our fictitious uh, Pearl Harbor. Then we've got us today, the heroes. We've got an F 16C being driven by Simba. Say hello, Simba. Hello. He's got four GBU-10. These are 2,000-pound uh, laser-guided bombs. He's got some sidewinders that we may use later on. If we succeed the mission, he's got a Lightning II teapot and a fuel tank, and that's going to be him. Me, I've got, again, four GBU-10s. That's 8,000-pound of bomb in total, plus a, uh, a Mark 84, in case I need it teapot and a couple of sidewinders as well and finally we have gary in the mighty tomcat say hello gary hello value viewers gary has uh, two gbu 10s and because he can't carry four for some weird reason on the tomcat he then has uh, a couple of gbu 16s so two 10s two 16s these are 1000 pounders fuel tanks uh, a phoenix just in case a nanton teapot and a couple of legacy sidewinders let's talk about tactics if we don't mess it up this should be relatively easy. Unlike the A-10, we really do have the ability to go fast, even when heavily loaded, than the World War II fighters. These guys will get up here and we will have 300 guys chasing us, but we can go 400 knots and nothing in World War II, at least that we're going to fight against, could go 400 knots. So as long as we just moderate ourselves, stick at Angels 20, it's 20,000 feet, stick at 400 knots, we can just take our time and sit and bomb those carriers. One other thing to add, guys, is that I have nerfed the carriers. You guys were saying that probably a 2,000 pound bomb, if it hits the middle uh, of a carrier, probably will take out the carrier. So what I've done is I've gone and fiddled with the files and I've made them eight times weaker. So one GBU-10 should put it out of action or almost put it out of action. Anything to add from you boys? No, nothing to add, just a few questions. I mean, what's the weather like today? Are we able to Beautiful. go in high? Yeah. Be low? Beautiful yeah. weather? Excellent. Yeah. And with these old ships, is there a certain direction they're more weak or more strong from? Not really. It's super simple damage modeling. Get the bomb in the middle of the ship. The ship should go down. Three, two, one, go. Okay, guys, uh, hang about Angels 20 or above. Uh, the, the hostile fighters just really struggle above that. 400 knots, right, let's think, think, think. Uh, uh, Simba's on 1588, Gary's on 1788, and I am on 1688, because I'm a lazy, lazy man. Air to ground, check. Weapons on, electric views on, mode, auto. I'm gonna do single releases. 
check. Next. T bolt on, check. That on, check. That on, that on. Okay, I'm going to designate 1.1 just to get firing roughly in the right place. Whoops. Right, uh, code, code 1688, enter, step. 1688, enter, step. 1688, enter, step. 1688, enter, check. Good. Yes, okay. Sorry so, if I... Captain, my laser might be set to 1688 on the jet. We'll see what happens. Roger, uh, you will. You can change yours, you can get Jester to change them. Your bomb should be 1788, by the way. Sure. Guys, I'm going for the one of the far ones, one of the far ones, because I'm just going to do that. Uh, okay, got point track. Oh, that's good. Designate target. Right, what could I have done wrong? Uh, got that on, check. Auto lays on, check. Point track on, ch check. Designate, check. Designate was tick check. 80 seconds to release. I'm going to check on the uh, hostiles and see how they're getting on. Okay. Lots of planes up. Looking at the map, there are about 20 aircraft up so far. 25% of those will be air to air and will come to shoot us. 65 seconds to release. I'm going to go after the closest to us. Okay, I'm on the furthest from us. 50 seconds to release. What have I done wrong? I've always done something wrong, so. The quicker we get these carriers down, the quicker the uh, hostiles will stop spawning. Okay, more taking off, probably about 25 airborne, and a guess. 10 seconds. 10 seconds. Well done, Gary. Getting the Tomcat to work. 15. Excellent. Hold. Cap. Bomb away. Right. I was ready to position. This is the first try as well, so. Be nice if we can get this working. 20 seconds till Cap's laser. Just trying to get myself to the bomb away. Alright, I'm not sure whose bomb I'm following, but hopefully it's mine. More planes taking off. Where's the laser? Five seconds till laser. Bomb is track. Not tracking. One of our bombs just went into the nowhere, so I'm going to try another one. That one's gone ballistic and not tracking. Try another one. Oh, that was hit. Yeah, my one hit, my one hit. <laughs> I'll take it, boys. Right. And it's destroyed, it's destroyed. The hero is destroyed. So that is one ship down. You two need to sort your bombs out. I don't know what you're doing wrong. Right, I'm going around to find a new carrier. Okay. That makes me feel a bit better about myself, guys. Very good work, Cap. So that is uh, 353 divided by 6. That amount of planes that are no longer going to take off. Okay, they still have five carriers. And they have maybe 30 aircraft airborne right now. Maybe more than 30 Just aircraft. Just over 70 aircraft you've wiped out. Wow. Hostiles are up to 3,000 feet. 23,000 feet, getting too high now. Cap turning back on into uh, to target. Come on, let's get another 70 aircraft. All the servers slowing down, that's because it's getting quite a lot of aircraft now. Right. Cap rolling out on target. And look for new target. New target identified. Point track, lock. Target locked. Reset saddle. Saddle reset. Bomb check. Bomb's good. Running in. 46 seconds. Going worryingly well. Right. Oh, yeah, they're up with us, guys. They're up at Angel 7 and climbing. One of you's got a bomb out, I think. Yeah, I do. I think um, Jess is struggling with point track. Yeah, so yeah, no track. Never mind. Let's keep going. 18 seconds. 18 seconds. Right, I think I've got everything ready. 10 seconds. Cap bomb away, check saddle. Saddle's good. 20, 30 seconds to a laser. Ballistics look pretty good. Three seconds to a laser. Laser on. And we've got guidance. Okay, here we go. Lots more planes taking off. Baby, come on, baby, right in the middle, boys, right in the middle. Boom. Yep, he's dead. He's All dead. Right. Second carrier dead. All right, Cap, stand by on dropping ammunition. Right. I'm oh. wondering if the laser code is off. I'm out of the area and I'm laser cold, so do your thing, Simba. I'll be away for another five minutes at least. Oh, so many planes airborne. 
Keep fast, guys. Keep fast. There's probably, I don't know, 40 aircraft, 50 aircraft airborne. Only four carriers up, though, which is nice. Munition away. Roger. Good luck. Oh, I see what you're doing, Simba. You're, you're, you're not... You're aiming at waypoint one. Press F6. See what's going wrong here. What you're aiming at waypoint one, which is where they start. So you've got a ballistic problem, not a laser problem. Not designating the target for the bomb right. It's a problem with the moving target. Right, I'm going to leave you to sort that out, and I'm turning back in. Right, could have a third carrier down very shortly. The further they get away from that waypoint, the less that ballistic is going to work. Well, I've got eleven thousand points for killing those two carriers. <laughs> How does that work? Running on target. Target identified. That is not valid. Track. Pass the info over. Saddle reset. I think that's me. I'm going for another, guys. Bomb's good. Inbound, 40 seconds. Maintain altitude, maintain speed. Okay, the fighters are now up here with us. We are now tangling with the fighters. Takes them a few minutes to get to 20,000 feet, obviously, as it does with any relatively slow aircraft, but they're here, and I am being surrounded by them. Remember, if it goes, if your lasers go pear-shaped, guys, you can use them as dumb bombs, remember? Cap dropping. Bomb away. Right, double check. Don't want to mess everything out. Saddle is on. Ballistics, I'm guessing, are good. We'll find out in a minute. Pretty good. Oh, one of the carriers is manoeuvring. Three seconds till laser. Checking, and we're hooked. We're hooked. It's going to be three carriers down. Still taking off probably 70, 80 aircraft airborne now. They take off at the rate of one every five seconds, I think it works out. Boom! Carrier down. Now we're cooking on gas, guys. Half, half the carrier force down. Probably, what would you guess, 70, 80 aircraft airborne now. Go on, Tomcat. Oh, Tomcat is out! Unlucky Gary. The AAA from uh, World War Two is... Yeah. Use your face if you can. Use the Tomcat for something. It's got a lot of K in it. Don't mind. We shall avenge you. Simba, ideally don't die, Simba, because I actually haven't got enough HG to do this on myself. Or we'll take out a frigate. There we go. Let's look at Gary. He never lets us down. <laughs> he tried. Bless his cotton socks. Oh, he might hit something yet. No control. Hydra oh. looks have gone. Roger. All right. Right, you can be GCI and help us not to get shot down because World War II planes are not to be messed with. Cap running in. Okay, Super Cap, you have a whole swarm of fighters coming up to you from the south. Excellent news. I can see, oh, I can see them. <laughs> yeah, they're they they around Angel I'm 17. Simba. Not that far off. Yeah, I can see them. Three, four miles. Leave me alone, last bitch alone. How's that bomb, Simba? That's he's got it. Simba's got it now, finally. Or well, very nearly, anyway. At least you're dropping it in the right place. That's a tally. It went very close to one. That's the good news. Oh, I got so low. God, I've almost got within triple A fire. But it just sneaks up on you. And I can't get my barometric hold to work. If you're wondering why I don't use it. For some reason, it never works for me. Right, regaining altitude. Okay, looking for targets. Target found and off and on. Simba, you are perched. You have a Mustang on your six. Oh dear, that'd be good. Right, I got that. Check. On. Send the data through. Check. Saddle. Check. Just keep them off for six, Simba. I'll do the damage. So you're flying into a whole swarm of them now, Simba. Watch out. Keep the discipline, keep fast, you should be okay, but don't dogfight them yet because... Yep, don't, don't, don't try them. I need you to, I may need your bomb, I will need your bombs at some point. Right, 26 seconds to release. Saddle, check. Info, check. Release in 10 seconds. Yep, I'm now being swarmed by friggin... Bomb release. Don't mean to mark your cap, but I wouldn't be counting on those bombs from Simba. They don't appear to be on his wing. Ah. Right, Simba, I may still need your KE, so don't die or do anything stupid yet. That's an hors d'oeuvre. Okay. Roger. Bomb... Ballistics are good. I mean, a plane smashing into a tower is probably going to take a carrier out to me. It's lazing in two. We're hooked. 
Oh, one of... Oh, no. Right. Please hit, 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 please hit. Yes. Oh, oh yes, I got it. Oh, God, I thought they missed for a sec. Right, four carriers down, two to go. I'm onto dumb bombs. Simba, do your best to just keep them off my back for a second. I've got to go try a dumb bomb. Which may be as stupid as it sounds, but I'm all out of laser-guided bombs, Valley viewers. So, uh, agent mode for mode, CCIP, M-fuse, nose, E-fuse, instant. Right, I'm going to go straight down on top of them, I think it's the best way for this. Oh, jeez, they're right behind me. World War II fighters are not to be messed with, Valley viewers. Yep, it's chasing me in a climb. But I am nice yeah. and light. If you keep your speed up, you'll be fine. Yeah. Simba, you have about 30 for me. Good, he's doing his yeah. job then. 30, but a dozen. Picking them all up. Done, guys. Oh, you're doing a fine job. You're doing a fine job. If you continue to drag them to the northeast, Simba, that'll be good. Cap, it's looking relatively clear over the fleet now. Roger, get in position. Some of the Mustangs are turning back on you, but should have another. Roger, control. I'm on burner now, so I'm on max. Right, mustn't mess this bomb up. Right, two carriers left, guys, two carriers left. I'm going to go for the rear one because it's going to be the less guarded, in my theory, by AAA. Also, I wonder if there's a weak point in the AAA. I wonder if it can look kind of vertically up. I don't know. I guess we're about to find out. Simba, a low swoop would be great for you now to get their guns on you. Low, but, you know, 600 knot low, so you can't get hit. Okay, Cap, that will drag many fighters back in your direction. Yep, it's okay, because I'm going to be in a vertical dive and then a burnout if I survive it. Okay, you do have altitude on your closest fighters, so you can keep the speed up. That'll be good. Running in now. Nay on vertical dive. Right, don't mess this up, Cap. You've got one job in your measly little life, and that's to drop this bomb. 22,000 feet. Okay. Paddle in case I need it. Air brake, not too fast. Okay. You Japanese. Yep, I'm drawing flak. Well done. Bomb away. Burner on. Come on, come on, come on, come on! Yes! Great. Another carrier down! One carrier left, Simba. Have you got any ordnance on you at all? I got four missiles in my face. Right, use them one by one. I'm going with guns, guns, guns. We'll finish the sucker off. It's the last thing we do. Remember, vertical dives work. Vertical dives work. Don't go in at, like, 30 degrees or something. I'm getting shot. I'm getting yeah, shot. You keep your speed up and get Roger. away from the ship. You're right over the fleet now, and you're dragging all the fuck. Roger. Okay, I'm kinematically good now. I'm like a bullet. Uh, AAA though. S fuel, 6,000. Gun paper ready. And caps in. They're doing evasive crazy Ivan, but it's not going to stop them. Tally the little Japanese fighters trying to get up. Look, they can't get up to me. Not 30,000, they can't. Running in. Okay, baby. Air brake on. Long yeah, taking out by the flag. Roger. S hopefully your body will hit him. So close. Missed by 30 feet. <laughs> yeah, Roger. The way God intended it, boys. Yeah, yeah. Shit, shit. No, no, no. Please. Yes. Paddle saved me. Did I wound it, guys? Mm. Oh. Stay no, uh, no damage. There is a lot of things chasing me, guys. Damn it, I put 500 rounds yeah, into really that are. thing. Not to worry, guys. I've been in worse situations than this, let's face it. I mean, Cap, can you, you do drag the, you do all the sliver of damage? Of the Say again, guys? Can you force them to kamikaze with you? I would love to do that, guys. Follow you right into the ship. I'm um, going for Sidewinders next. Hey, look at them, follow me. You crazy little okay. guys. Someone co altitude with you. Uh, stop your belly now. Excellent. Right, better get going fast. So they, some of them wait up. They're using her tactics, not her, just swarm tactics. Some of them are waiting up here for me. Right. Fuel is. Okay. Right, I'll do my Sidewinders and then I'm going in with face with maximum KE. That's bound to work. I'm running in now.
Right, don't lock onto anything weird, please. Where's the boar's sight? Where is the boar's sight? Stop speeding up. Don't rip the wings off. Air break out. Go, guys. Right, if I can lock those guys on there, that's a hit. Hits. 9% damage. I'll take it. Let's go again. And I nailed the planes on there. Oh, Jesus Christ. That was so close. You're out of stab and one motor. Oh, you're kidding me, right? I don't need that to put my face into it, boys. I don't need that to put my face into it. These are so dangerous. It's so hard. You can see why with the 810, it was just impossible. Even with jets, it's horrendously dangerous. Right, guys, I'm going for max KE, max kinetic energy. That can only mean one thing. Mm. I suppose I'm not going to need my canopy anymore, boys. It's open. And it's gone. Here we go, guys. I've lost control of the plane. Oh, I've lost control of the plane. No, I'm good. I've got minor control of the plane. Right, rudder, it's all in the rudder now. And your motor's back. Yep. Oh, and it fixes itself. Oh, no impact. Are you kidding me? Oh, dang it. Oh, well. <laughs> that was good fun, if nothing else. Uh, can the... Oh, look, I have done damage. Look, I've done, like, a fifth damage. Uh, can a single F-16, F-18, and F-14 destroy the Imperial Japanese carrier group? Yes, easily. We almost did it with just me bombing. 27,000 boys. I've never had that many points. Uh, boys can... What was you boys' problem? They just couldn't get their lasers firing. I don't know why. I need a bit more practice for Jeff today. If that was working, we definitely would have wiped the carrier group out. I, Easily. I think we, we, he, we could have wiped, probably. If, if everyone were quite their t bolts working, we could have wiped all the, well, most of the destroyers and cruisers out, I imagine. I, uh, one thing it shows is how deadly warp, warp, uh, World War II warboat swarms are. I know we keep getting, getting a load of jip because we keep losing our A-10 missions, but you try doing it with a bunch with a warboat swarm, off, swarm after you. Try your mill sim then. It doesn't work. You, you know, it's really hard. Even in, even in these planes, it's hard, guys. It would keep you busier than you might think. That's done. Yes, it's easy, pretty much. I hope you enjoyed that and see you later.